Okay, um, thank you for your paragraph. Now let's have a look at your paragraph slowly. Your topic sentence is this, contributing and so on. Okay, which is very good. Then you explain that with the field of energy which they contribute and so on up to here. It's very good. Your keyword here is, is contributing, okay? Then contributing in the field of energy include thermal power, um, thermal power energy, then you have hydro here, then you have geothermal energy, okay, wind and thermal power, okay, very good one. Then your paragraph or your sentences after this should explain this one, and should explain this one, sorry, this one, should explain also geothermal wind. Now let's have a look at that. Then you said Toshiba was involved. This is good. It is true, but that's not support what you have said above. So this sentence is irrelevant. They also supply essential equipment for Patuha geothermal plant, okay. You mentioned geothermal here, it's, it's related, very good. But then you said the company has contributed to the development of this up to here. Uh, that's become irrelevant because uh, you did not connect this sentence with this. Unless that you mentioned what's happened in Malaysia for over 30 years. This is supported geothermal, hydro, or uh, wind. So if the sentence just like this, that's become irrelevant. To make it relevant, you have to rewrite that. Yeah. Then you mentioned by combining expertise and so on and so on. Okay, that's mentioned in the text, but doesn't support your paragraph here. So this is also irrelevant. Then you said with more than ta 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 ta, ta same. That's irrelevant with what you said above. So. Discuss again with your friend if you're going to write is contributing in developing South Asia future energy, the field of energy which they contribute, then you mentioned this. You have to develop this idea. Uh, you can give incident, you can give example <clears throat> how or the incidents, what happened, what they have done in Indonesia, what they have done in Malaysia and so on and so on in relation to this. To make it neat, then you have to in, uh, explain first is thermal power energy. Okay, give example and so on and so on. Then you have to explain more about hydropower and geothermal energy and wind energy and thermal power. Um, I think you mentioned two thermal power, thermal power energy and thermal power. What's the difference? And you have a smelling mistake here. Okay, so discuss it with your friend and organize your paragraph. This is a lot of sentences that not relevant and not supporting your topic sentence. Thank you.